day explaining the compensator. So there it is. That compensator is about four feet long. And when you go around a corner, it slides out because your pivot point's right there. So what would happen is if you didn't have a compensator or like the old school trailers before they had compensators like that, the, um, the reach would slide in and out of this, uh, what they call a car body or trailer body. And this is the reach right here, that square steel piece. So if you didn't have either a reach that slid in and out of the car body for when you went around corners or a compensator up there, what happened is when you went around a corner, it would try and um, tip your trailer over or it would like strip the, the logs off of the bunks, which is, this is a bunk right here on this trailer. And then, as you can see up in front, there's the bunks there. That's what holds the logs to the, um, you know, that's what holds the logs in. So, compensators and, and um, sliding reaches are essential for log trucking. Um, I made the mistake when I first started trucking, and it happened again after I started, was I left my bale latch. This is the bale latch right here. I left that latched so my compensator couldn't slide out. And when I went around a corner, it um, the gravel was soft enough to where it tried to run me off the road. I couldn't steer at all. But if I was on pavement, you know, and with a load of pulp or or something like that, it would it would strip the load off the truck and be completely screwed. Um, you you flip your bale latch down and it catches on that like when you're driving down the road um, with the trailer down and so that's how that all works